Pleasure to know that you're watching New Vision TV's Pearl of Africa Diaries with me, your pearl guide, Ruth Nasege. And today's adventure is in Mukono district where we find Sezibo Falls. These falls are a preservation of an ancient African culture and its captivating natural beauty has transformed it into a popular destination for exciting nature adventures. Some of these include natural walks, photography experiences, zip lines and not forgetting cultural experiences. So join me on this exciting adventure. Uganda is endowed with so many features and Sezwa Falls joins the list of so many of them. When you make a stop at Sezwa Falls is a must recorded vist in your travel diary. The experience, the atmosphere, the nature, the water, the river, the sounds, the birds, and the rocks are among the so many unique features you would love to record in your diary. Sezwa Falls has an origin. On river Sezwa stems these falls. This river is relatively small and it is found in the southern central part of Uganda, particularly in Buyukwe district. It has a total of about 150 kilometers from the source to the end. The river's origin is quite interesting. It is connected to the Uganda culture and the story behind it is that it was born by a Muganda woman named Nankungu Tebatusa, whose husband was in Suga Sebato. As she made her way to Kavmabu Kunja, Nankungu gave birth to twins in form of water. One of the twins was River Sezibwa. The name Sezibwa is derived from a Luganda phrase, Sezibwa Kubo, which is my path can never be blocked. It is further explained that the river's flow could not be stopped even with different obstacles it encountered along its 150 kilometers. And now we have a river. The other twin river is called Buanda. From this river, then through the rocks, we have Sezwa Falls. The falls are seven meters high. Water pushes through the rocks and flows down the bottom. As it touches the ground, it uses excessive force as it is seen splashing. From the cliff, it appears white, but as it settles, it joins a narrow path of brown water. And there it flows and enters Lake Choga in Kayunga district near the town of Galilaya. The surroundings of Sezwa Falls are birds of various species, tall trees, pines, huts, and the greenest vegetation. This is a perfect definition of a beautiful scenery. The beautiful view is accompanied by the waterfall marked with sharp edged rocks and a splendid sound of waters flowing down the indented rocks. This brings enjoyment and relaxation as birds and monkeys sing and jump respectively from the surrounding rainforest. As much beauty is being processed, these red flowers just could not hide away from our sight, leading us to the very many exotic plants that find shelter in the surroundings of Sezibwa. 
This place is a hive of activities you definitely have to indulge in. First is the exploration of animals that keep hiding in the trees. Among them are the red-tailed monkeys and the velvet monkeys. Others are tree squirrels, Nile monta lizards, green mambas, and horned adders. If you're good at bird watching, Sesva Falls is a place for you. Uganda has over 1,000 bird species. Sezwa Falls area is among the so many places where you will find a number of birds. As you can see, most of the trees have been crowded with nests. Another interesting activity here is rock climbing. Cultural practices loom around this place. Some of the huts you see below are shrines where people come for worship and also perform cultural rituals. It is said that people come here for days depending on their requests to the goods. Many seek for blessings while others for removal of curses. Other activities you could try are hiking, nature walks and research on the vegetation. The several tree species here are used for medicinal purposes. Besides tourism activities, Sezwa Falls is an educational center where students come to study about waterfalls and rock formation. The additional sightings are the sunset. This could best work for couples. With this setting, trust me, there are a number of promises you can make to each other. But these can be experienced after a 40-minute drive from Kampala to Kayanja in Buyuke district where Sezwa Falls are situated. I always tell you New Vision TV's Pearl of Africa Diaries is home of adventures and it is my duty to bring them closer to you. So till next time, I am Ruth Naseje. Thank you.